Well, we have been tracking the rain totals for this month very closely. Take a look at this. We are creeping closer and closer to that number one spot in both Colorado Springs and Pueblo. And we still have six days left in the month to get over half an inch of rain in Colorado Springs and right around about a half an inch in Pueblo. We are going to be tracking that closely, especially with more rain in the forecast almost every day this week. Skycast is showing that the storms that we're tracking outside currently impacting the Pikes Peak region. They're going to continue drifting off toward the south and east, bringing more rain to the plains as we head through midnight and into early tomorrow morning. By tomorrow morning, as you're waking up, heading out the door to school, work, or wherever your Tuesday morning is taking you, you'll notice a mixture of clouds and sunshine. Should see enough sun where tomorrow's temperatures are going to end up quite a bit warmer than we were out there today. Enjoy the first half of the day. That's going to be the best part. During the afternoon, that's when we're once again going to get the storms to roll off the mountains and move over the I-25 corridor. Expect to see that rain pushing through Colorado Springs around 4 o'clock, and we will keep the storms in place as we take you through the evening. By 7 o'clock, could get some heavy rain around Denver, around Colorado Springs, and Pueblo. Heavy rain if we get that to move over area bird scars or areas that have just had a lot of rain over the past couple of days. Flooding is once again going to be a big concern. Storms tomorrow should not be severe, but we could still see some decent sized hail and again, heavy rain could cause some flooding concerns. So we'll be tracking that very closely. Stick with us through your Tuesday afternoon. We'll keep you ahead of the storm. By midnight tomorrow night, everything is going to move off to the east and come to an end. So it's really just going to be the late afternoon and evening when we'll have the best chance of those storms pushing over the I-25 corridor and then out across the plains. Take a look at these high temperatures. Temperatures will hit 68 degrees in Colorado Springs tomorrow. We'll warm it to 76 in Pueblo with temperatures in the mid to upper 70s for the southeastern corner of the state as well. And if you think that sounds nice, we'll wait until you see how warm it gets on Wednesday. Wednesday, we're bumping the temperature into the 70s for Colorado Springs. We'll stay there on Thursday. We're going to decrease the chance for storms Wednesday, Thursday. We'll still keep that slight possibility. We could have some spotty storms moving overhead during the afternoons, but looks to be much quieter Wednesday, Thursday before. Another cold front moves through, and that's going to kick up the chance for storms Friday into Saturday. Could see some severe weather for the end of the work week. First part of the weekend, we'll have to track that closely, and then temperatures dropping back into the 60s and then 50s through the first half of the weekend. Pueblo tomorrow, we're at 76, but we'll warm to 80 degrees on Wednesday. We'll drop the temperature back into the 70s on Thursday. Thursday, not a great chance for storms in Pueblo, but that changes Friday into Saturday as we get a bit more active across southern Colorado. Canyon City, tomorrow, your high Temperature 74 degrees. We'll warm it to 78 on Wednesday, drop the temperature to 76 on Thursday. Our cold front moves through and we will spend the weekend in the 60s. Teller County, almost a daily chance for showers and thunderstorms, but the most active days will be tomorrow and then again Friday into Saturday. So those will be the three days where we should see uh, the most action in the weather center. But other than that, at least the temperatures are going to warm up. I mean, 70s and 80s. Do you guys even remember what those feel like? <laughs> Not know. really. It's been so long. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Now, as we said earlier, we're that close to the record, mm -hmm. so we might as we well might, just, yeah, just break yeah. it. Let's Celebrate. start. Cheering.